hi everyone and welcome in this video we will see how you can create your own opc us server using the lab view okay so once you create your own opc us server in the lab view you can you know extend your project to add folder inside your opc us server you can also add a tag inside you, uh, those folders also you can convert your lab view project into the exe file which you can install in multiple system and you can create you know customize opc us server in multiple systems okay so this is a very helpful project and in this video we are only going to create a basic opc us server and after creating our basic opc us server we are going to test the connectivity with the opc uh, ua expert software okay so once we have created our opc us server using the lab view we are going to connect that opc us server with ua expert software and we will see the connectivity between two softwares so here is our lab view project to create our own basic opc us server so we will first open this lv project file which is our you know lab view project file okay so here is our project explorer and here is our vi file okay virtual instrument file in which we have created our basic opc us server so you have to double click on this and it will show you this window okay this is our gui or you can say our main screen window and here you will get the endpoint url of your opc ua server okay once you start or once you run your project you will see the endpoint url of your opc us server and you can specify your opc us server name so i'm going to specify opc us server fusion automate okay here is the tcp port number on which your opc us server will be started okay you if you want to change then you can change tcp port number if you want to trust all the client then you can you know enable this if you don't want to trust any client then you can disable this okay if you want to stop your opc us server then you can click this button to stop your opc us server and here what security policy is supported by our opc us server that you can you know select and specify here and if there is any error while creating opc us server then you will see this error here okay if you want to hide anything then you can also hide if you want to change something or if you want to change the size of any you know object then also you can do it in the lab view okay so we will click on this run to start our opc us server okay so our opc us server is up and running you can see the port number 49580 okay which we have specified here and we are going to trust all our clients so that is why i have selected this button now we will open opc ua expert i mean sorry ua expert software to connect with our opc ua server which we have created using the lab view so we will you know copy the endpoint url we will click on this plus icon we will go to advanced we will paste the endpoint url here and here the configuration name is lab view opc us server and then we will press ok and you can see it is connected okay if you want to read uh, you know basic server data then you can you know drag and drop this and you will see the basic server data okay you can see here uh, our server name opc us server fusion automate okay so this is how you can create your own basic opc us server with the help of lab view okay if you want to see how we have programmed it then you can click on this window button you can click on this show block diagram and here you will see so we have used this create vi to create our opc us server to start our opc us server we have to use this start vi it will continuously run okay in the while loop and it will update every data at 200 millisecond and once you stop okay once you click on the stop button it will turn off the while loop and it will stop the opc us server and then after it will close all the connections okay so let me stop the project and if you want to you know uh, get this vi then you can get it from uh, data communication and then opc ua okay if you want to create opc us server then you can see opc us server here you will see create vi okay so you just have to drag and drop this to create your uh, opc us server and here you have some uh, inputs okay opc us server name so you can uh, 
specify your OPC US server name here. You can specify the TCP port, supported security policies you can specify here. And here, if there is any input error, then also you can specify it here. And if you want to trust all the clients or not, then that you can specify here. So if you drag and drop this, then ju you just directly create this, right click, control, uh, create, control, okay? So it will create a control for you. You can see OPC US server name two, and you can see here. Okay, so this is how it will create control for you and you can directly connect everything and you can start your OPC UA server. Okay, the start VI is also available here. The stop VI is also available here and the close VI is also available here. So this is our basic OPC UA server without any tag, without any folder, without any security. Okay, we haven't, uh, you know, configured any username and password. For this basic opc us server so if you have any requirement to create basic opc us server then this you know uh, lab view project will be useful for you for testing purpose okay and if you want to add some tags some folders and if you want to use it in the production then also you can extend this project and you can use this in the production you can also create exe files so if you want to create an exe file then you just have to use this build specification okay so right click and it will give you the options it will take some time to give you the options here you can create a new you can click on new and whatever type of application you want to create you can uh, you know select it from here if you want to create an exe file then also you can uh, create if you want installer okay so installer will be like uh, you can install entire application without any dependency in another system okay so it will create a package for you you can copy paste the package in another system and there you can install it and it will start running your opc ua server so this is how lab view will help you to create your own opc ua server also you can customize your opc ua server as per your requirements so i hope this thing is clear and in the future videos we will cover how to create a folder in your opc ua server how to add tag also how to import folder data and tag name from csv file so you just have to create this one application you just have to provide the csv file and it will automatically generate or you can say it will automatically create opc us server for you with those folder name with those tag inside this folder okay so i hope this thing is clear and if you still have any question or any doubt then you can always ping me on telegram instagram and whatsapp and uh, till then mm, take care Goodbye and thank you.